everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armour and I'm reviewing ETFC. This was a gap today and I and I did like it. It was up initially out of the game but then flipped. Um, this was a stop but if you stayed on top of it you could have retaken it. I mean I, I did not but I mean you certainly could have here in the afternoon. This is falling. Uh, it, it rated okay to do it and again it was profitable initially but it wasn't enough of a move to, to get out. Uh, so I mean we didn't. Um, actually, I think a couple people in the room might have scalped out of this, but that's really not what I do. All right. So this rallied, and this looked great. Dropped, fell in here, boom. Um, and again, looking for a bigger move in this. So, I mean, especially if you waited for the confirmation, it really just, it wasn't just enough, okay? And this held for so long. I mean, this looked like it was going to hold, looked like it was going to hold, looked like it was going to hold. I mean, it's held. It, this held, actually. This held for a long time. Yeah, it was actually about 1040. So this held a while, but it never really got the momentum under it to the downside here in the morning. And it looks like it, it, it did then around 11 o'clock. Hit the high at 11 o'clock and never looked back. So I knew this was a short usually like to do the quick trades. This was not a quick trade today. You had to have patient and wait till 11. I did not retake it. I didn't retake it. It was an earnings play. It was a news related thing. It, it was fine, but you had to either stay on top of it, do it twice or get out quick in the morning, which I didn't do. So decided to go and look at something else. Uh, we did the HPE, but this did end up working. So if you stayed on top of this and retook it, it worked. So it, this was a sloppy though at best. Um, and some of that had to do with the placement of the gap here. Um, some of it also had to do with the bullishness in the market. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you, the market's bullish. It was bullish today. We ran out, we made brand new all-time highs in a SPY. We came down here in the afternoon, but all in all, uh, this market is, it, it was extremely bullish today. So to short anything today, it had to show weakness and almost immediately, um, especially to get the follow through. So each trade is closing week. It may follow through tomorrow or not. We'll look at something new, but it did end up working, but it was not easy. And you had to wait and retake it a second time around or just wait all together. So each trade is a loss today, but HPE worked. We will see what happens tomorrow. Have a good day, everyone.